Okay, this is the second video in the bookshelf tour, and this time I'm going to be covering uh, YA fiction and children's fiction. Um, I will warn you guys, I know a lot of you are really excited to see YA fiction, and because I've only gotten back into YA fiction since February, really. Um, my collection of YA, current YA fiction is not very extensive, so just warning you, but I will show you everything I've got. Okay, so let's get started. We have the Mortal Instruments series by Cassandra Clare, City of Bones, City of Ashes, and City of Glass. Beauty by Robin McKinley. The Blue Sword by Robin McKinley. Sunshine by Robin McKinley, Anna and the French Kiss by Stephanie Perkins, The Hunger Games Trilogy by Suzanne Collins, so The Hunger Games, Catching Fire, and Mockingjay, Fallen by Lauren Kate, Torment by Lauren Kate, Perfect Chemistry by Simone Elkalez, and for right now, those are the current books, um, current YA fiction books that I have in my library, but I'm sure there will be more, uh, many more. Um, next, we're going to go on to the YA fiction um, and children's fiction that I have that are not so current. First, we have Two Moons in August by Martha Brooks. To All My Fans with Love from Sylvie by Ellen Conford. The Hobbit by J.R.R. Tolkien. The Wolves of Willoughby Chase by Joan Aiken. Little Women by Louisa May Alcott. Tuck Everlasting by Natalie Babbitt. The Indian in the Cupboard by Lynn Reed Banks. The Marvelous Land of Oz by L. Frank Baum. The next are by Judy Bloom. Uh, so we've got starring Sally J. Friedman as herself. Then again, Maybe I Won't. Otherwise known as Sheila the Great. Super Fudge. Fudge Mania. Double Fudge. Just as long as we're together, here's to you, Rachel Robinson. The Incredible Journey by Sheila Burnford. The Secret Garden by Frances Hodgson Burnett. Alice's Adventures in Wonderland by Lewis Carroll. The next few are going to be by Beverly Cleary. So we've got Emily's Runaway Imagination, Ramona the Brave, Ramona and Her Father, Ramona and Her Mother, Ramona Quimby, age 8, Ramona Forever, and Henry and Beezus. Next we have What Katie Did by Susan Coolidge, Harriet the Spy by Louise Fitzhugh, Cassie by Marilyn Kay, Pippi Longstocking by Astrid Lindgren. Next we have books by L.M. Montgomery, so I have the Anne of Green Gables series, um, Anne of Green Gables, Anne of Avonlea, Anne of the Island, Anne of Windy Poplars, Anne's House of Dreams, and then Jane of Lantern Hill, and Pat of Silverbush. Then Pollyanna by Eleanor H. Porter, Roller Skates by Ruth Sawyer, and then we have my uh, Laura Ingalls Wilder Little House books. I don't have the whole series, but I have some of them. Uh, Little House in the Big Woods by the Shores of Silver Lake, These Happy Golden Years, and then we have uh, kids' books, like little kids' books that I've had since I was really tiny and have just been important to me. So I'll just go through these really quickly. First, we have the American Girls Collection. Um, these are the Samantha books. Um, Samantha was the doll that I had growing up. And so that includes Meet Samantha, Samantha Learns a Lesson, Samantha Surprise, Happy Birthday, Samantha, Samantha Saves the Day, and Changes for Samantha. Next we have Love is a Special Way of Feeling, If I Found a Wishful Unicorn, Paddington and the Seaside, and Madeline and the Bad Hat. Next we have Little Gorilla, The Runaway Bunny, Good Night Moon, and You Read to Me, I'll Read to You. Then May I Bring a Friend, Caretakers of Wonder, Oxcart Man, and even if I did something awful, Mousework, The Guest, The Giving Tree, The Muppets Go Camping, and, and then Eloise's Guide to Life, Father Fox's Penny Rhymes, and Alexander and the Terrible, Horrible, No Good, Very Bad Day. And I do have more children's books um, that I'm going to show. They're in a different place on my bookshelf. They're the larger hardcover, so I will show those in a different video. 
Okay, so we've just covered uh, my current YA fiction along with my older YA fiction and children's fiction that I have on my shelf. I know some of you are probably disappointed that there isn't more current YA fiction. Um, I am building my collection slowly but surely, so I should have more in the next, you know, couple of months. But um, anyway, the next, uh, oh, just to show you how much we've covered so far. Um, so we've covered this shelf, all of it, and then we've covered just a tiny bit of this shelf, so we still have much more to go. Um, the next video I'm going to do is going to cover my TBR shelves, which will include these shelves right here. Lots of books on my, P on my TBR shelf. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you next time. Bye.